So for the first step, if we do any of this, you want to head over to search and then type in task manager. Click on it. Now, if you see Apex Legends running, you want to close it. So just right click on Apex Legends if you see it and then click on end task. So guys, for the first method, you want to head over to search and then type in network reset. Click on it. And then click on reset now and then click on yes. And then you want to see if that works for you. Now for the second method, you want to head over to search and then type in Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Advanced Settings. Then you want to click on Inbound Rules. And you want to click on New Rule. Then you want to click on Port. Click on Next. And then you want to click on UDP. And you want to type in 49152-65535. Type that in the box right here and then click on next. Click on next again, click on next. And then for the name, you could just put anything, but I'll just put Apex Legends, click on finish. And then see if that works for you. Now for the next method, if you're running Apex Legends on Steam, then you wanna right click on it, click on properties, and then click on installed files, and then click on verify integrity of game files. Now if that's still not working, you wanna head over to search and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Now once you're on this, you want to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush dns and click on enter. Then you want to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on enter again. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 